It's been over a week now since Kaylin Lowry gave birth to her third child, and there's still so much we don't know about the whole situation. Like, we don't even know the kid's name. But, lucky for us, Kaylin is on a reality show, a reality show about being a mother, no less. So we're not completely in the dark here. We know that she gave birth at 3 a.m. on August 5th, and that it was less than two hours from the time her water broke till the time her son was born. And thanks to some photos she was kind enough to share on social media, we know that the baby is just as precious as her other sons. We also know, thanks to a new interview with In Touch, that Kaylin's ex-husband and the further of her second child, Javi Maroquin, is actually pretty cool with the whole thing. Lincoln knows he has a new baby brother, he explains. Like all kids, they are excited to have a new sibling. I have to remember to say brothers now instead of just Isaac. Javi also says that whatever issues Kale and I had cannot impact Link's relationship with his new brother. So I do make him excited about it. While we still don't know how Kalen's third baby daddy, Chris Lopez, is going to do with this new baby, it's nice to know that she chose amazing men to father her first two children, right? We should have known that even though Javi and Kalen's relationship has been extremely volatile since they filed for divorce, he'd put that all aside for the kids, even baby Lo. After all, he still spends time with Isaac even though at this point he's technically just his ex-stepfather. Oh, but back to the interview, remember the thing about how Javi could legally be considered the further of Kalen's baby? As a lawyer explained it to In Touch, Delaware law states that the ex-husband is presumed the father of a child if the child is born less than 300 days after the divorce. We still don't know the exact date that the divorce was finalized, but we do know it happened sometime in November or early December. Meaning that since the baby was born on August 5th, well, it sounds a little too close to call. However, Javi says everything should be taken care of on the legalities of the new baby, I'm pretty sure. He doesn't sound super confident, does he? But thanks to a recent interview from Kaylin. We do know that she was able to list Chris as the baby's further on the birth certificate, so hopefully they really have worked everything out. Precious little baby Lo doesn't need any more drama in his life than he already has, that's for sure.